So in today's video, I'm going to tell you about three most usable Chrome extension that one can use to make his or her life very easy in a technological way. So without any further delay, let's get started. So first, we have awesome screen recorder and screenshot that lack a proper screenshot tool with the ability to record both audio and video within the browser to take a screenshot of any web page. So uh, for that, what you have to do, go to the extension icon, press it, you'll find your extension that is awesome screen recorder and screenshot. So I'll uh, make you understand with the three screenshot that I'm using right now. The first screenshot you can see is having four options that is desktop, camera only, this tab and customize. So we have to select the desktop one. There will be a screen that you'll see uh, in which you have three options that is Chrome tab, window or entire screen. I'll choose the entire screen as I need the entire screen to be recorded. I'll just click on it and press share. So this extension gives you a very good quality of the screen recording. So I hope this will help you in the near future or is currently helping you very much. So moving on to the next one. The second one is the black menu. So basically black menu for Google makes it easier to access Google services when you are not on a Google owned site on any website. Just what you have to do, just select the black menu icon from the upper right hand corner. You'll see some of the most popular services here in the black menu. So what you have to do is if you want to maximize the screen, you can maximize the screen also. If you want to add more services, what you have to do, it's very simple. You can go to the customize. You can customize all the services. Once you click on the customize, there is a new tab open just beside of the list where you'll see many Google services. You can just customize it. If you want to make a list according to your services, according to your preferences, you can just do so. Just left click on it, hold on to it and drag. So this will rearrange your list as per your will. If you really want to add some of the services into your present current list, you can also do that. Just left click on it, hold on it and just drag it to the list. It will directly get added into the original list that uh, you are having right now. If you find your list very clumsy and you don't want to use many services, so you can also delete uh, those services from your list and uh, you can only choose those services that are very beneficial and uh, you can use in your day to day life. So, yes, it is the whole process of the black menu. So moving forward, the number three Chrome extension that I'll recommend you is block sites. So basically, there are particular sites uh, that uh, gives you regular pop ups or advertisement uh, that currently shows up in your screen that you don't want to see. And you really want to block those uh, websites so that uh, you'll never get distracted from those uh, websites, right? So if you are facing these kind of problems, what you have to do, just go to Chrome Web Store and add block site Chrome extension. After clicking on it, the extension will open itself. You can see in this, there is a space called enter a domain example facebook.com. So in this gap, what you have to do, you have to paste the URL of uh, one particular site that you want to block. For example, I've copy paste the URL of uh, indeed.com. So I'll just copy the URL. I'll paste it and press enter. So this will show you all the blogged website that you have already blogged. So these are the top three extensions that I'll recommend you that uh, will be very useful for you in your day to day life. And uh, that's all for today. I'll meet you in the second part of this video. Thank you.